Hello everybody and welcome to a guide on how to massively improve your FPS when playing modded Binding of Isaac using the lossless scaling application on Steam. As most people that have played the Binding of Isaac with mods will know, the more mods you install, the laggier the game tends to get, especially with multiple large mods at the same time, and this can be annoying as it may limit the potential of your modded setup as you may not be able to install all the mods you want due to the lag that it adds. This is where the application lossless scaling comes in. Lossless scaling allows you to use upscale methods to upscale a windowed game to full screen resolutions and implement frame generation on games that do not natively support upscaling or frame generation. In the background you can see my game running with lossless scaling enabled on a run that would otherwise be incredibly laggy and nearly unplayable. A few notes before I show you exactly how it works and how I have mine set up. Uh, this application does cost, but it's quite affordable at only 589 UK, so that shouldn't be too much for most people. And this can be used on most systems, but to take full advantage and get the best results, it's best to take a look at the recommended system settings on the Steam page for lossless scaling and just see how your system stacks up to that. And lastly, upscaling and frame generation can result in some input delay and latency. Personally, I haven't noticed any issues with this in Isaac, but it will depend on the game that you're playing and also your tolerance for that latency. Once you have purchased Lossless Scaling and installed it, you can begin to set it up. Upon opening the application, you'll be greeted with this settings box. As you can see, here are the options for scaling mode, type and frame generation, as well as profiles so you can have different settings for each game if needed. The settings I personally use for the Binding of Isaac are a scaling type of LS1 with the sharpness lowered to zero and performance disabled, custom scaling mode with a scaling factor of 1.3 and resize before scaling enabled, and frame generation set to LSFG 2.3 and the mode set to times 4 with performance disabled. These settings should work well for most people, but please be aware that I'm running in RTX 4090, and so the ideal settings may differ for each view based on your system specs that you are running. So if the results with these settings aren't ideal, tweak them and test them until you achieve the result you want. And there is plenty of community resources on the Lossless Scaling Steam page that will help you to de uh, decipher what each setting does and what is the best for your different system specs. There are also some other settings, but none of them are required. So do feel free to look through the Lossless Scaling app and take a look at them, but know that you don't need to tweak anything else in there. In the settings though, you should enable Start as Administrator. Once you have tweaked your settings, you can now launch the Binding of Isaac and make sure that both uh, Binding of Isaac and Lossless Scaling are open and make sure that Lossless Scaling is not minimized. Now that the game is running, you can hit Control, Alt and S to activate the scaling. You should see your game window briefly shift and then in the top left you'll be able to see an FPS counter with two numbers, one being your actual FPS before scaling and the other being your new upscaled FPS. If that worked correctly, you are now done, and you can now play the modded Binding of Isaac with little to no lag. One thing to note though, is that if you're on a particularly laggy run, like sub 15 actual FPS before scaling, then you may notice some slight visual glitches, such as a little bit of warping and potentially some texture flickering, but this is usually quite minimal and usually doesn't come into play on the average run, so it's not something you should really have to worry about. But there you go, that's it done. You can now play modded Binding of Isaac with amazing FPS. So I hope this guide did help and go and enjoy your new lag-free Binding of Isaac experience. Thank you.